<laughs> this seems to be my uh, my happy season for uh, receiving and uh, presenting awards. And uh, if there's any truth in the axiom that it's better to give than to receive, well, then I'm uh, I'm about to enjoy the best of experiences. Uh, this award is in recognition of an incredible talent, a superb actor, composer, lyricist, director, and playwright. He's all in one. He's a man who has immeasurably enriched the theater for over half a century. His wit punctures the world's pomposities. His melodies haunt the world's memories. And his indomitable spirit and then realizes with amazement that the same man wrote Design for Living and Brief Encounter and Private Lives. Thirty years ago, he presented me with a personally inscribed copy of Tonight at 8.30 and also a copy of Present Indicative. And also two of his then recent scores, A Words of Music and uh, Bitter Sweet. And I've often wished that I could present him to something that he too could treasure as I treasured his gifts. And tonight, thanks to the American Theatre Wing, I can. I can present this very special Tony Award, which in a sense is also personally inscribed by me, by everyone here, and by each loving member of the theatre. It goes to one of the world's blithest spirits, Sir Noel Coward. This is my first award, so please be kind. <laughs> I would like to say to you that I've been in the theater for 60 years, and the most rewarding thing in the world is to be appreciated by one's own people. And often when I have given a performance of incredible brilliance, <laughs> the civilians have come around. <laughs> and I've said to my few pro friends who were skittering about, stay where you are. <laughs> because what I like his praise from my peers. And this moment tonight makes me think with the greatest tenderness and affection of an old friend of mine, Antoinette Perry, who was, as we see, the greatest theater enthusiast that I've ever known. And I'm so proud to be here and receive this. And thank you all so much. 